hey guys what's going on so it's swiss again and the big news is out patch 3.0 is out and there are some changes we need to go over specific specifically with snake and we have four big changes as you can see here um back air has extended launch distance distance when hit in the high damage range up smash has increased vulnerability side special reduced the attack range of airborne missiles and neutral special reduced reduced the power against shields there's been a big change against um against most projectiles doing less shield damage and we'll go over that as well as the differences in patch 2.0 and patch 3.0 so we'll go over that and go from there enjoy the video so i made two videos here one being version 2.0 you can see how far it goes here and it lands right in that spot and then version 3.0 you'll be able to see doing the same exact thing it lands in the same exact spot version 2.0 just a different area in Hyrule Temple here, making sure I'm on the ledge. Same spot as you can see here on that top platform there. Version 3.0, same exact thing. Lands on that same exact top platform. Spun in a few circles here. You can tell it does three circles. Start from the bottom before it, it cancels out. And then version 3.0 does the same exact thing. So personally, I'm not too sure what the difference of the Nikita is or what they mean by the Nikita change. So if you have any more insight than I would, please definitely comment down below. But uh, let's go ahead and move into the next detailed patch. One thing to mention about the up smash that apparently people have found out is that it has a four frame end lag now. So it is a little bit slower. So you could be able to tell from a little bit on this here. But, uh, this is pretty much the change for the up smash. So there's four frame, four frame end lag at the end. I'm sure this update was made in general to stop up smash spamming at the edge. Cause I'm sure there were a lot of people that didn't know how to get around it or were pretty annoyed by it. So I'm sure that's why they made this patch. So not terrible, but Something to definitely consider for the people that do up smash, that spam up smash on the edge, to not do that anymore, or you'll be left wide open. So definitely stop doing that. Or you could still do it, but you have to be more cautious now. Next up is those legs, that back air. Let's do it. So first things first, with the up air having incineroar jump i was able to kill at 135 and then from the ground i was able to kill at 140 on version 2.0 in version 3.0 i was able to kill him 127 from standing and then from jumping as well 127 so big change back air buff is a big thing because that's really going to lead into more kills i'm sure ally is super happy about that because that's one of his best aerials that he lands most often but getting those back air reads off of ledge now is going to be very crucial and then you can get be able to get um kills that way or maybe off stage bear might help you guys too so bear is going to look a lot better so we might be seeing a lot more bear being used with snake so i would definitely recommend playing around with that and using it a lot more and see what we can do with that and the last thing is the b button the nade special so as shown here you can see how much shield pressure the grenade does in version 2.0 quite a chunk there and then 3.0 barely anything big big difference oh, oh my god hello so projectiles all together have been changed um precisely that most projectiles i would say like 90 percent of them don't do as much shield pressure as they did before which is good or bad because that leads us to being able to approach more with grenades and not having to worry about our shield being hurt by them. So that's a plus. Um, we can't really use them to pressure our opponents as much as before. So that's that's kind of that's that kind of brings it down a little bit. Um, shield breaks aren't going to be as often as they used to because of grenades. So that's another thing as well. So. It, I mean, it, it's pros and cons, pros and cons, you know, so not too bad, but you know, it's, it's whatever. 
all in all, I don't think it's anything bad as far as Snake has gone with the patches that would make him change and getting better or worse. Uh, especially with the back air buff. That's really, really big. What do you guys think? Let me know. Put it in the comments down below. Let me uh, let me read through those. I'll reply. You know, you guys always know I reply. And thank you so much for watching the video. It's mad late. It's like 1.30 in the morning. Um, took forever to get the update in. You guys know how it is. I'm not going to even play Joker. Forget about it. We'll do it another day. But uh, yeah, I'm excited. Can't wait to play again. Let's see how Snake has gotten. Share some more some more uh, news for you guys as far as anything new in the 3.0 patch. If we find anything out with Snake, if you guys do, let me know. Don't forget to subscribe. And thank you guys so much for watching the video. Have a great rest of your day. And peace.